on drugs continues inside the Pike County Jail. The Pike County Jailer says he's taking a stand. During a routine check, he says guards found four inmates with drugs behind bars. WYMT's Chandler Markey met with one of the inmates to hear his side of the story. Guards inside the Pike County Jail were doing their usual hourly check on inmates Sunday when they noticed something suspicious. Upon the uh, arrival of the two guards, they noticed uh, four inmates at a table and they thought that they may be a little high. Uh, they acted a little intoxicated, maybe. After further investigation, they say their suspicions were right. We made a decision right then to go ahead and shake the pod down and find out what's going on. And upon shaking the pod down, we found uh, Suboxone. Uh, one of the uh, inmates had it uh, in his sock. Uh, the other inmates had it in their possession. Inmate Robert Scott was one of those four. He says he's been addicted to drugs for 20 years. As they come in, shook down, and come to my cell and found a little piece on the on the bed there when they shook the blanket out. Which I'm a, I'm a drug addict. If it's there, I'm gonna do it. The jailer says all four inmates have been charged with having contraband inside the jail. Lewis says he wants people to know he's not playing games when it comes to drugs inside his jail. All of them need some help. You know, a lot of people think, you know, well, if I get charged, you know, you charge them and leave them in jail for 10 years and they'll stop that stuff. No, it's an addiction. These people don't just stop because they get charged. Being charged with promoting contraband inside the jail is a first-degree felony. In Pike County, Chandler Markey, WIMT Mountain News. The four inmates charged are Bradley Newsom, Robert Scott, Brandon Hatfield, and Dennis Smith.